today I'm reviewing the Benefit Cosmetics Professional Pore Minimizing Makeup. And really quick, I just want to say purchase all these products with my own money so you know you can trust my opinion is what I honestly believe. And this is meant to be almost a, a primer and foundation kind of combined into one. And there's five shades. I have shade number two, and I just want to say that this is a sample product that I got. The full size is $30 and is half an ounce. So this is just a little sample I got. But the full size looks almost identical, just larger. But it's got a cap with a sponge on the one end. And then you would unscrew this, and you've got the makeup. So let me just squeeze a touch on. And I've been using a beauty blender the times I, I applied it. Um, I seem to have better luck with that, but well, you just squeeze a little bit and just apply it onto your skin, and it's kind of supposed to be like a primer foundation. Um, and the first thing, the very first time I used this, I noticed the fragrance. It's very fragrant. Fragrance is one of the top ingredients on this product, so that to me was instantly disappointing. Um, and if you have large pores, I don't know if I would expect any miracles from any product. But I would definitely recommend if you have a beauty blender or another sponge to use that because this sponge is just too bristly. It's just not soft enough to fully applicate your face and apply a good amount of coverage. Or if you're looking for lighter coverage, it, you kind of just get one option with this. So um, I wish this had sunscreen in it. That would make it more of a useful product instead of just having a primer and foundation kind of combined into one because then you're still gonna need to apply it sunscreen either on top or underneath it. Um, so they could definitely have made it more of a universal three-in-one type product instead of just going for the makeup and primer. Um, I kind of think this product doesn't know exactly what it is. Um, just reading kind of the descriptions that I've read online, it just isn't sure what it's supposed to be doing and it seems like they had a new idea but didn't quite know what they were going for with this. Um, reviews on it that I've read are kind of all over the board. Some people have liked it, a lot of people have really disliked it, and there's a lot of people in the middle. Um, so um, with my opinion, I definitely take into effect the fact that as fragrance, if it did apply better and looked better, um, the fragrance isn't as big of a deal, but for me that's my uh, score breaker, tie breaker there. So for me, unfortunately, I give this two thumbs down. I'm interested if you guys have had a chance to try this or any other benefit products. They kind of have cute packaging, different different uh, marketing. I'm not exactly sure if they're marketing towards younger ladies with their marketing, but they definitely have different packaging and things. So um, anyway, feel free to leave a comment and let me know what you think. And also feel free to subscribe. I come out with at least one new review every day. Thank you guys.